Hello, I'm Ben. Um, I'm from Australia, from Brisbane. I arrived here a couple of weeks ago. Very happy to be here. Yeah, let's go FC Seoul. Fighting. <laughs> yeah, fighting. <laughs> Meu nome é Ricardo Silva. É, sou do Brasil. Estou muito feliz de estar aqui. Espero que venha ser um ano de muitas conquistas. Venha trazer felicidade para todos os fãs e para nós também que estamos doidos para conquistar grandes coisas. <laughs> everyone was very, very welcoming. I joined the team about 10 days ago. And yeah, everyone was really, really friendly. A fair few of the boys can speak a little bit of English, which is helpful for me, especially Osmar and, and Paulo. The, but yeah, the feeling is really, really good. Now I'm just looking forward to, to starting the season and playing some games. Cara, a sensação é incrível. Está saindo fora do Brasil, lugar muito quente. E a primeira impressão quando eu cheguei aqui foi o que é que eu estou fazendo da minha vida, muito frio. E Cold. quase que fiquei louco na quarentena aí, mas sobrevivi. E a sensação de estar com o grupo é muito boa. Me sinto muito feliz, foi muito bem recebido. Let's begin to Big Brothers, someone Young. They, they, need, they need to learn this, Hyung. Hyung, his big brother. They say Hyung, the oldest. Okay. Someone here is older than you. You say Neyman Hyung. Osma Hyung. Maybe sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes oh maybe you heard some. Yeah, player. okay. Os Hyung. 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 And what's little, what's little brother? <laughs> little Osmar brother? Hyung. Yeah. Common sense. So but they, they don't say. Older to the young, okay. the name is fine. Okay, 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 okay. So we're here with the two new stars. <laughs> I think even in this cold weather, I hope that they felt both welcome, as Ben said. And again, as he said, we are all looking forward to start the season. I think this year, these two will bring us a lot of points, a lot of success, and I'm sure this year will be totally different. I hope. I've been already three so so years. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to play with them, especially with him together on the defense line. And I want to see his skills among Palo and the other attackers. Let's see what we can do this year. I think for him it might be a little bit easier. You now he, he played in Germany, Japan. I bet you've seen already football is quite different, quick, fast. And uh, what I would say to both of them is um, Korean football is quick. I think it's really important to use uh, the head as we're working in our trainings a lot, as our head coach <laughs> requires. <laughs> My advice is, uh, yeah, think as quick as possible. Comer muito peixe, cabeça de peixe no Brasil fala. Comer muito peixe para pensar rápido. From now on, only fish head. <laughs> Actually, I sent him already because I know his wife is here and alone now. And I sent him already one, um, one <laughs> Insta for Instagram account for what things you can do in Seoul, what places you can visit. I'm sure that maybe this profile can help. You can ask me or my wife as well. She's busy with two kids, but <laughs> we, we can help. <laughs> well, maybe my girlfriend can babysit. That would be great. <laughs> that would be the best. Well, my girlfriend loves kids. She doesn't want, really? to, have, she doesn't want to have kids yet, but she loves kids. Uh, I'm, I will introduce you my, to my wife for sure. <laughs> Oh, there you go, she has a job now. Perfect. Yeah, babysitter, because Ricardo has four kids. Se ele quiser, se ele quiser, eu dou quatro para ele. Yeah, I heard. Wow, that's a lot, man. <laughs> you know, so I remember when I was here, I think a little bit, a little bit mistake when, what happened at the beginning is that you compare everything with your hometown, with your country. It's, ah, oh, this is not like my home, this is not like my home. And my advice is forget about that, you know, it's open your mind, try food, try to visit any places. Maybe this is a good opportunity to get to know different things. That's how I see my journey in, in Asia. We are so lucky to stay in Seoul. And all the respect to other teams, but I think there is not there is no other city like Seoul to you know, to have experiences. Because how long have you lived in there? Eight years? Uh, seven, seven, actually. I was four and one in Japan and now three. This would yeah, be my okay. eight. In the first fourth, I had more time to visit places and the city itself. As soon as the kids came, it's more difficult. Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> so now that you don't have kids, go ahead. <laughs> go outside. Go yeah, okay. outside. Take advantage. Yeah, yeah. I'm not sure. Uh, I don't know how he will move 
in the city, you know, with four kids, you need a, a van or something. Explore after, you can explore He can use our bus. I need sponsor. É boa. Aí tem que ser o ônibus mesmo. Qual foi a maior experiência dele dentro do que ele adquiriu dentro do desses sete anos dentro da da liga? This this question is very important because this guy is true legend, true legend, legend, legend. This is something they say. The best moment, the, the best season here was in 2016. I was very lucky that the head coach gave me the captaincy. That year the team just played amazingly good with a good character. We went for the winning every game home and away and, and I remember playing not being worried about the result because I knew we were going to score and even though we conceded but we were not worried at all and that feeling was really really cool and obviously at the end of the season winning the title, raising the trophy and all this experience. This this feeling and trainings in the games it was really important. I think since then, since then, I think the team went down, 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 became middle table, and I didn't have this feeling again until the last games of the last year. It was it was quite good. We were fighting for relegation, so it was hard, but but it was the same feeling that the team was pushing forward, attacking, and well prepared to attack and to win, not to not to defend and stay back. As I said before, I think they just came in the right timing and I would like they can feel the same things that I felt back in, six, in 2016. It's not just because I'm here for a long time, but uh, this is not the normal club in Korea. It's, they will see when we get in our stadium, you know, the, they, will, they will feel it. We are the, the team of the capital and coming in the pitch, winning games there, it's, I'm sure it feels different than playing for another team. I hope that they can get this feeling and we can we can get it all together again. Wow. <laughs> the champions. We have to come back to play Champions League as well. Mm. I really miss that competition. <laughs> we actually played against one another when he played in Thailand. Yeah. Like 10 years ago, we just realized. I was playing for Brisbane and then I, we flew to Thailand to play Ram United and we lost on penalties. Yeah. But I obviously didn't know Osma was playing for Bororam. No, I, it's not like we remember the, the game, how it went. I remember because Thailand is, uh, we were like the smaller team and winning to Australia team was huge for us, especially in, in penalties. Mas o que me chama muita atenção no que Osmar falou aqui é a respeito do sentimento que ele teve no ano que ele foi campeão. E eu acho que dentro de nós existe um verdadeiro campeão, né? E esse ano nós temos que, que resgatar esse campeão dentro de nós para que possamos, é, 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 no final dessa temporada, fluir, que esse, esse, esse campeão possa aparecer mais forte com o título, com todas as batalhas que enfrentamos no dia a dia e juntamente com a nossa torcida, nossos fãs, de estar visitando, nós vamos querer conquistar alguma coisa I want to raise some trophies too before I finish my career. You're running out of time. <laughs> Clock is ticking. <laughs> well, yeah, it's a real honor this to sit next to this legend right here. <laughs> I think when I found out that FC Seoul was interested in signing me, I was really excited because I've actually visited Seoul a couple of years ago just for, just for a holiday. And if you look at South Korea, Seoul is by far the, the capital city. It's where everything is happening. And I think there's only one team that represents Seoul, the city. If you look back at your career, you remember the moments when you win trophies, even if it's if it's a World Cup or if it's a, a cup competition, you know, winning trophies is the best best thing you can do. So I think winning a trophy this year would be the ultimate goal. Fighting. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope that this this year is a turning point for this club, for for, for the team. At least I think now we, we know what where we are going, what we want to achieve and what is needed. I think this represents you know what F Sol is, it's not just a Korean team, it's more than that. It should be. So hard, honrado in chegar no CU e ser muito bem recebido por todos, principalmente pelo Osmar. Na minha memória, felicidade. Eu sou grato é, por tudo que, ele, que não somente ele, mas todos os outros jogadores estão fazendo por mim. Procurar me ajudar, 
E aí eu vou procurar aprender o inglês também o mais rápido possível. E esse ano, a única coisa que, eu, que, eu, que é o meu desejo, que é a minha esperança, que é o meu sonho, é, é de conquistar grandes coisas no clube. Então... Eu não sei também. Coração. Coração. É, eu também. Não. Brasil. Ah, sim. Sim, sim. Pequeno. Anhão.